If you were in Sears as an executive during that time, you would have seen a world that was collapsing. And if you were an executive in Amazon at the same time, you would have seen a world of growth and hope and it's exciting. And so those two, same world, two different frames of view. Depending which one you were in, you saw collapse or hope. That's at a company level. But what would happen at a monetary level that affected every other decision on the planet? That's what's happening at Bitcoin. Two frames of view, one hopeful, abundant, and growing fast, and then one collapsing and getting worse and worse and worse. And the people that are racing and giving more power to the one that's collapsing are, are actually making the one collapsing stronger in control over them. And the people that are just walking across the bridge um, to, to Bitcoin are making that system stronger. Um, if Sears had failed in 99, people would have really cared. When Sears failed later on in 2010 or so, nobody cared because the new transition to the new system was more complete and they were getting more value in the new system. But that's what's happening today on Bitcoin. Thank you.